Welcome back to The Witcher 3. I think it's time to go talk to the ancient called Hendrik in the village of Heatherton, which is pretty close to me. But before doing that, I feel like doing some adventuring. So let's go north and check out these question marks. Looks like there's a cluster of them here. Looks like there's some sort of a building as well, kind of on a little mini, mini island. Looks pretty cool. Let's go check it out. Hopefully this episode won't have any sync issues that the previous one had. That was annoying. I don't really know why I'm going this way. I don't know if this is going to take me where I want to go. Uh, Yeah, it'll be fine, I think. Yeah, there's a road right here. Oh, actually, let's just follow the main road. Follow the GPS. Turn right in three miles. Recalculating. Recalculating. Oh wait, that's right, I'm not actually following the dots because I'm not following the main quest. Right. Ah oh, well, this works anyway. Harpy feeding ground. Does that mean... <gasps> that means harpies! Okay! <laughs> yeah! I was just thinking, that thought just hit me as soon as the harpies hit me. Run, Roach! Run! Also, I need to meditate because I don't have any thunderbolt or, or swallow. Oh god! Oh my god, that is so creepy the way they fly after you. Holy shit. Oh my god. Uh, I'm guessing art is effective against them, just as it was. Just as it was with the griffin, I'm hoping. Okay, oh my god. <laughs> that is terrifying. Oh, Jesus. Uh, Roach? Roach is still over there, isn't he? Come here. Alright, let's meditate. It's 2 a.m., let's meditate until uh, daylight. Okay, there we go. Much more pleasant. Let's see if they're in my bestiary. I think you have to actually fight them for them to be in there, but let's see. Nope. Alright, in that case, just use my potions, if I need them. Given that there's a swarm of them, I'm guessing I will, and yeah, I'm guessing art is probably going to be effective if you hit them while they're flying after you. Because that was very effective against the griffin threw them off balance and uh, made the griffin just like fall on the ground and stunned it for a couple seconds. So I'm gonna do Quen to begin with, but then let's try Ard. Alright, come on. Fight me. How do I make them come down? Actually, you know what? I should probably use my crossbow. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, Jesus, there's so many of them. Holy shit. Ooh, there we go. Okay. doing execution moves on them. I guess when they're on the ground, maybe that happens. I expected more of them to mob me, but I'm actually doing okay. Alright, come on. I guess I have to make them fall out of the sky and then shoot them. Or, <laughs> hit them with my sword, rather. Execute them. Come on. Yeah, they just fall out. Right out of the sky. Very, very easy. Just one hit. Oh no, I missed my opportunity! I think it's calling for backup.
Yeah, these actually are not too hard. I don't need to use any potions or anything. Plenty more to go, though. There's even more. Holy crap. The hard part is actually getting them to come down. They're so far up there. You might even be able to just ignore them at this point. Ah, oh, somebody got murdered up here. she has been here a while. Flies buzzing around. Poor woman. Getting mobbed by a group of harpies is no fun. And I just stood on that dude's face. I'm so sorry. Kinda. Ooh, beast oil. That's gonna come in handy. I probably could have used that against the werewolf. And I can definitely use that against wolves. Sweet. Alright, how close am I to the question marks? <laughs> Not very close. I'm so close to this question mark, I guess I might as well just check it out. Oh my god. Oh my god. That view. There's probably going to be a better view somewhere over here, so I'm just going to wait <laughs> until I stare at that. And this looks like a place of secrets. I'm going to save because I'm probably going to fall and die. Yeah, let's not go that way. Um, What's the best way to get to that question mark? I think I need to go down, actually. I think it's more on the coast. Let's see if there's a way over here. <gasps> Can I actually get up here? Oh, I want to get up here. Come on. Come on. Yes, yes, yes. Don't fall off. Please, please don't fall off, Geralt. Oh, is there an invisible wall? Come on. I don't think I can get up here. Ah, nope. Is that thing? What is that? Is that a uh, what's it called? A, a basilisk? Basilisk? Cockatrice? Something like that? And this view. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, well this thing's probably going to kick my ass, but I do believe it is the question mark. Yes, it is. It is the question mark. Or it's guarding the question mark. Oh god, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Easy, easy, easy. Fuck off. Alright, you can stay there, Harpy. Yep, that's a basilisk, and it's level 14! Oh my god. Okay, uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like instantly die, but let's try this. I'm gonna take all the potions. But you know what, I should check out the weakness weaknesses first. Let's see, I didn't know that is gonna matter. Oh god. Oh, is it not here yet? I guess it isn't. That, like, didn't make any noise at all.
Alright, Art is probably going to be a nice thing to use when he's coming at me. Alright, this time I'm going to Art it. Okay, got us both. Why is that not making any noise? And it spits. Okay, that made noise. Jesus Christ. I haven't gotten hit yet, but it's probably going to do a lot of damage when it does. Okay, I've hit it multiple times, but I've done barely any damage. Like, no, this this isn't gonna happen. There's no way I can live long enough. Ah, oh, I missed it. Come back here. Okay, that's not doing huge amounts of damage to me. But I think most importantly, I'm not doing huge amounts of damage to it. This fight will last like an hour. Yeah, I can't, I can't do this. No. There's no way. I mean, there is a way, like, I could do it, but I would have to grind it out for like a half hour. That's not worth it. Yes, that is, that is a fascinating game. Do I actually have to watch this? I don't know why it, like, forces you to watch this damn thing every time you load a game, it seems like. Unless there's, like, a special button to skip it that I don't know of. Anyway, let's go around here. Which unfortunately means I think I'm gonna kind of have to go around the basilisk unless I can make my way back up here. Oh yeah, there we go. I don't want to fight you. But apparently you want to fight me. I'm just mashing keys, I don't even care. What now, you piece of filth? There's something down there in that whoa 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 whoa. There's something down there in that valley. It's actually surprisingly slow and kind of hard to turn Geralt around, by the way, which is why it's incredibly dangerous to go up to edges. Like if I press the back key right now. It takes like a second and a half for him to actually start moving the other way. Bigger tick blossoms. Don't think I've seen that before. Yeah, this place just looks special, doesn't it? Like, I wonder if you have to do a quest here or something. It feels like something's supposed to happen. Like, maybe, uh... Maybe this is, like, a meeting spot? Maybe I should use my senses. Oh. Don't see anything. Oh, cool, there's a little walkway. Well, okay, kind of. And Oh, Jesus! Alright, we're good. For a second I thought those were harpies in the sky. 
Nope, just normal birds. Oh shit, there's stuff in the water. Uh, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. I don't know mm -hmm. what's in the water. Magic. A place of power. I see stuff on the map. Like, right here. Where is it? Is it above me? Is it below me? It's like right here. Oh! Take this, uh, and I'm gonna go. Whatever that is, it did not attack me. Thank God. Something sounds weird. What is that? Oh, it's the sound of them swimming. Can you like go underneath this island or something? No. Weird. No. There we go. I don't think it's supposed to come from this angle. Although it's kind of working. I don't think it's going to continue to work. Let me in! No. I gotta go up. Mm. I'm stuck on trees. Let's try this way. There you go, Geralt. That's the spirit. Oh. Somebody doesn't want me to be here. It's a fast travel sign. Maybe this is another quest thing. Somebody will open it for me at some point. Nah, there's gotta be something I can do. Okay. That's a thing. I don't know if it's progress, but it's a thing. Oh, he's still gonna fall. <laughs> what am I doing? <gasps> oh, Jesus. Oh my god, this might actually work. I'm gonna make a permasave here. Um, let me see if he can grab onto this. Can he grab onto that little stub? Don't kick back, don't kick back, girl. Jesus Christ, don't kick back. Uh... Um, alright, let's... Oh my god! I think I just did it. <laughs> Holy shit! Get indoors, get indoors! It's on the roof. Put your sword away. It'll go away. Just be quiet. Shh, 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 shh. Okay, there we go. Oh my god, I just snuck into this place by glitching the collision, basically. Or, well, nah, let's be, you know, let's be fair with myself. I'm just a hardcore parkour girl. Ooh. Diagrams, repair kits. Let's check out the trousers and the boots. Might have some new swag to put on. Hmm. Nope, that's worse. 
That's also worse. Moles. That thing's just waiting for me. Oh my god. I think I'm gonna take my time in here. I think I'm probably never gonna leave. <gasps> oh, that's armor and it's a relic. Let's check out it that out in a second. I'm guessing it's better than what I have, because I think relic tier is pretty good. I didn't mean to do that. I meant to light the candle. I'm not sure if lighting those things makes it harder or easier to see, because it makes the HDR go kind of crazy. I'm guessing this is the way you were actually intended to get in here. Some, Yeah, some sort of underground pool, which explains why I heard stuff swimming beneath. Alright, well, I think my way is much, much cooler. Cutlass, decoction, oh Jesus Christ, gauntlets, sword, this place has some good stuff. I don't know what the fuck is swimming down there, I don't know if I want to know, let's check out my new equipment first. There it is, hmm, let's see, alright so it's a little bit worse in terms of armor but only slightly. Plus 43 vitality. That's uh, that's a small increase. It's something. 25% resistance to slashing. Only 15%. Eh. It's not better. It's pretty close. But it's not better. I do want to know what it looks like, though. Eh. I like that more. Not better. The same. Actually, no. I think that's a little bit worse. Doesn't have as much resistance. Yeah, what else did I get? Anything else I should look at? Jesus Christ, I have so many crafting ingredients. Sort items. Okay, I'm a little bit curious what's swimming down here. Level 10 drowners. Okay. Oh, you can use your crossbow underwater. I didn't know that. I don't intend to stay, though. Get me out of here, please. Probably better if I leave through the water rather than go up up here. With that thing waiting for me. But there's some more stuff to loot out here. Let's let's just hope it doesn't notice me. Be very, very quiet. Put that out. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, I'm gonna hope Roach will come across the bridge to me, and I can sprint away on Roach. Oh, Jesus. It's right up there. Ooh, enhanced saddle. That's gotta be better than the current saddle I have. I only have a normal have saddle. Enhanced has to be better, right? 25 stamina. 20 stamina. Alright, so a little bit more stamina. Don't think that increases the carry weight, does it? That's my carry weight, right? Yeah, it doesn't change it. 
But it does mean that Roach can sprint a little bit, a little bit further. <laughs> this ladder climbing camera is sickening. It just bobs up and down. Journal. Could be a quest item. Another saddle. An another saddle. Now I'm overburdened. Well, let's dump the rusty sword. Damn it. No, what did I just drop? I forgot you have to click the thing and then do the thing. Come here. Alright, well, the saddle's actually really heavy, so I probably should drop that. Well, they are, they are worth quite a bit. I'll drop the old saddle. I'm keeping my trousers. These things are pretty light. And swaggy. Look at that. Yeah. Probably dump the other saddles. Ooh, my old crossbow. Let's dump that. Alright, that's fine. Oh yeah, let's see if that thing's a quest item. The journal? Indeed it is. Da's chewing my head off about going to the lighthouse. About the fire needing tending. Thing is, don't give a plow and rat's arse, frankly. What am I, some golem? Fit for naught but climbing up there four times a day to drop off wood and pour oil? I'd much rather learn how to work a forge in town or at some gnomish foundry. Grandpa Emsvari was a smith, wasn't he? He even forged witcher blades, so who's to say none of his talent trickled down to me? Wait, so why is this a quest item? Oh. Is that him? Is this the, uh, the lighthouse? It must be. Some gauntlets. Poor guy. Jesus, he got gutted. Torn apart. Hmm. That's still worse than what I have. That's good. And you can hear the wind. Wonderful sound design. Let's get a look at that thing down there, if I can. Uh, I can't. I can't look down anymore. Can I dive into the water from here and survive? <laughs> you can! Although I was expecting him to do an actual dive. He just, like, hit the top of the water. That actually looked really painful. Alright, I want to try fighting that thing. It's, it's probably way too high level for me, but I want to try it anyway. Skip it! Skip it! I wonder if it's actually covering up the loading time? I don't know. I feel like the loading time would be faster, though, because... I don't know. It just feels like it'd be faster. Ooh, it's trying to fly around now. Okay, let's loot quickly. Never mind, I can't loot. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. It's a wyvern. And it's level 14. Yep, that's not gonna happen. A 
Abort! Roach! Roach! How, what the, how did you get there, Roach? You are a magic horse. Come here. You can have the loot, I don't want it. I have enough, goodbye. Oh. I might be able to get the loot if I lure it away and then go back up there and just try to loot really fast, but uh, no thanks. I'm good for now. Alright, let's go do the main quest. Oh god. Don't get stuck. Don't get stuck. Ooh. Is this place snowy? That or somebody went really crazy with a powdered sugar. Must have been a huge baking accident. Air is strange. Like dropping into a deep cellar on a hot day. And the mist. Yeah, this doesn't make any sense. You don't go from, like... Fairly warm temperatures, as far as I can tell. Everything over here seems green and... You know, nobody's breath was misting in the air. So it seemed pretty temperate over here, and you don't go to such cold temperatures that stuff is frosty this quickly. That just doesn't happen. Also, a really loud Whoa. plane is flying overhead. Ooh, I think I see... Yeah, I see enemies on the minimap, so let me uh, rest so I can get my health back. Alright. What are we going to be fighting here? Let me switch to bombs. What do we got? People? Mutants? Rabid dogs. Level 2. Oh, those aren't going to be a problem. There's got to be more to this place than rabid dogs, though. Rabid dogs don't cause a, a small, controlled bubble of coldness. Doggies? What happened here? Be gone! Leave me be, whoever you is! Get away! Calm down. It's over. Aye. It's over. All's past, never to be restored. I'll not forget that ever. Looking for a man named Hendrik, supposed to live in this village. Aye, he did. No longer. They nabbed him in that hut. If you'd have heard the cries, sir. If you'd have heard how a man can scream, how he can suffer. Tell me what happened here, step by step. They took him. Took him all. The sun was waning, see? And the dusk went crimson like blood. Thought to myself, strange. The toads, I cannot hear them. The Wild Hunt? It's gotta be the wild hunt. That's right, they do cause frost, don't they? The wild hunt. I was in Geralt's dream. I know not what happened there. 
save terror through and through. Hendrik screamed. Then he begged. By the end, he could do naught but moan. the terrors, yet the village froze like in the heart of winter. You in that hut when they rode off? No, and I'll not set foot there. Never. Farewell, and peace of mind to you. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure why Geralt's response to that was great. <laughs> that sounded really weird. This game is... God, I really like this game, though. That whole flashback thing. That was just so well done. Even the frost is well done. Just the look of frost on stuff is so cool looking. I wanted to see if it was destructible. It's because he was left behind. Him. Maybe they missed something. Need to check his pockets. Trousers are stiff, as if hung out to dry midwinter. Maybe hid something in his jerkin. Damn, he's cold as ice. Nothing here. Should check his boots. Blood. Congealed. Key hidden in his boot. Gotta fit a keyhole. Somewhere nearby, hopefully. Hmm. Little hatchway under the, uh, bearskin rug. There's a draft. Gotta be a space under this rubble. Guess I should do some cleaning. Mm-hmm. Missing, Tamara Stranger, daughter of the Bloody Baron, presumed kidnapped. Hearty reward for whoever finds her or brings her in. Valuables left unlocked, on display, almost. Lost his mind, or... Hmm. Must have missed something. What did I miss? Oh, a secret lever, perhaps. Mm hmm. Interesting.
A ledger. Payment for a sack of grain. Amount due for a charcoal shipment. Hendrik was masquerading as a merchant. Hmm, what's this? Notes among the ledger entries. Clever. Interesting headings. Missing and wanted. Subject appeared in Skellige. Also sighted in Novigrad. Appearance unchanged. Ashen hair. Scar on her face. Avoids contact with others. Drunken swine. So-called Baron hosted subject at his castle. Or should I say, illegally appropriated fort. Reason unknown. Talk to Baron at Crow's Perch. Clashed with a witch. Subject landed in swamp, encountered a witch. Conflict ensued. Cause unknown. Find the witch. Talk to the peasantry. Village of Midcops. Caution advised. I'm being observed. Don't know by whom or why. Unsettling signs. Dog ran off. Water in bucket froze solid. Strange glow observed in the sky. Ill omen, peasants say. That's right, that guy a while ago, the, uh, the innkeeper, was it? I was asking around for where to find my contact. Didn't the innkeeper say that from the village where my contact lives, he saw a strange glow in the sky? Somehow they learned Hendrik was looking for Ciri. That's the torture. I'm too late. My only leads, the Baron, and some witch. Damn. Go to the Baron's castle. So we're gonna go meet the Bloody Baron? I'm sure he's a swell guy. I wanna get out of this damned village. It's dreary and depressing. Come on, Roach. And how far away is the castle? Oh, that's not too bad at all. Jesus Christ, look at all this. Oh my god. All of this. I mean, essentially what I explored in this episode was like... This. In like 40 to 45 minutes, this is what I explored. And this is what's on the the whole map just for Velen. All of this just for Velen. Go to the world map. There's Velen, and then Novigrad, and then Royal Palace and Vizima. I don't know if that's really that big. Uh, Skellig Isles, and I'm sure there's other places, probably. I'm assuming, like, almost all of this will be more places I can go to later. So, Jesus Christ, this game is big. Oh. Alright. Well, I think I'm going to end this episode here. Let's get a good view. I guess the village makes a better view. Depressing, but more visually interesting than that. The gray sky. There we go. Let's observe the work of the wild hunt. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.